Ah, oh, Tower Cam singing some Bon Jovi today. It's Friday, y'all. And even Tower Cam, our eye in the sky who we've personified, is uh, jamming out to some Bon Jovi. Welcome back to Indy Now, friends. The Wine Trough is a mobile bar that brings the party to you. And today they've brought the celebration to our Indy Now backyard. Jillian is out there live to show us more. How's it going, Jill? Hi, Ryan. Okay, so we know it's cold and rainy today, but the weather is about to get nicer. I'm so excited to show you the wine trough. They bring the party to you, like you said. Lacey and Chris are the owners. They're the ones who transformed this mobile bar cart and so much more. Lacey, <laughs> tell us all about the wine trough. So we are a mobile wine bar. We also serve everything local. We do local beers, local mocktails. We do craft cocktails based on the season. And we do have our charcuterie with us today because we are a full charcuterie board facility as well. Oh, yeah. You guys hear that? Not charcuterie, charconery. Yeah. We're going to talk about that. Now, wedding season's coming up, all kinds of outdoor events. So you're going to take me through something that you might bring to an event. So what have we got here? Okay, so we do have our spring and summer drinks coming in. So to the left, you will see our cranberry and vodka, and then you will see our ranch water. Yep, and then ranch water right here in the back. And then our charconery here. And then we have a blue spritzer that's coming out for summer as well. This one's super fun around the pool or on the lake. And then, of course, all of our wines, which we're going to go over some tastings this Ooh. morning. Okay, yeah, twist my arm, you know, Lacey. <laughs> so we're going to go through a tasting, but I know you mentioned, like, by the water. Yeah. So not only do you have the wine trough, you right. also have another resource that people could use maybe if they're out on the water as well. Yes, so we have a pop-up rustic, and it's basically two large wine barrels and then a very oversized piece of beautiful oak wood that we take. We put it dockside on Morris or Guys for all of our concerts, or we can go interior if you have an interior party. Uh. I cannot wait to book you guys for something. Okay, so let's go with the wine tasting, yeah. Lacey. What's up here? Okay, so let's go dry to sweet. So okay. the first one you're going to try is the Norton Seedling. Again, we serve all local wines. So this is made in Noblesville, Indiana from Country Moon Winery. Oh, that's good. Yeah, it's a Norton grape grown mm. right here in Indiana. It has about a 17-year-old vine on it. Wow. And then this one is the Wapahani White, great with chicken or fish, a very clean wine. Oh, that's refreshing. Yeah. That's, that's, that's very refreshing. I like that. And then this is a sweeter one. It's called Sunbonnet. We actually mix it with our sangria that we make every year, put a bunch of fruit in it. Ooh. This one is a sweeter white. Ooh. Ooh, I like that I like one, that too. One. Okay, and then I served you a whole glass of this one. This is our number one seller, Concord Mist. It is your everyday red wine. You can drink it any season all year long. Oh, I feel like it's summer now. <laughs> Never mind the rain. We're ready. Uh, I know Lacey was like, what kind of wine do you like? I was like, all of it. So um, I love also that you support local. I know that's a big part of what you do. It is. Um, we are local entrepreneurs. Uh, my husband's a local firefighter, been around 25 years. I own a local business in Cicero. So all firefighters get a free beer with us. Um, and we try to use as much local as we can, local drinks, local everything. So. Uh, I know Chris was saying, he's like, I'm not the talker, but Chris, I got to give you a shout out really quick here. How fun is it to play bartender at some of these events around town? It's, it's a lot of fun. Uh, we get to spend a lot of time together and meet a lot of new people. Yeah, <laughs> okay. Charconery. How did you come up with this? So this is what we call a COVID friendly charcuterie board. It's to go. Basically, you don't have to share with your friends. You can each have one. You can walk around these while you're at a wedding or a corporate event and have your very own while you're, you know, drinking or tasting or talking. So they're just very fun and to go. They're great for the water as well. Um, just full of summer. <laughs> and you came up with this. I love this. Yeah, uh, we use um, uh, basically their uh, bamboo. Their bamboo style. So they're um, healthy. They're more environmentally friendly too. Yes, that helps. Okay, this last drink over here. You told me this one was a little dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> this one's a little strong this morning <laughs> while we were making it. It's our new blue spritzer that'll be coming out this summer. It's oh. just got a little kick to it. Oh. Well, you know, I'm not, I'm not afraid to give it a try for the viewers. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> got you a blueberry. <laughs> oh, that is good. Like sneaky. Yes, very, very good. <laughs> Let's tell people because I know so many people have summer events. Maybe it's, you know, a party that they're hosting at their house or their neighborhood and they want to make it special. Yeah. How can they book you guys? Uh, so you can go to our website, which is just winetrough.com, or you can check us out on Facebook or Instagram at The Wine Trough, and we'll give you a free quote. Yeah. Um, and then today you also get a free hour of service if you book and you mention Indy Now. 
Oh my goodness, thank you guys for doing that. So if you mention Indie Now, you get a free hour of service through the Wine Troth. So go to their website. We've got the information on the screen. If you want to call, check them out online. And I am telling you, these drinks are great, and I love that you support local. So for now, I think I'm just going to sip on this. I'm going to pretend like it's warmer, and I'm going to send it back to Ryan. Cheers, Ryan. Cheers to you, Jill. Thanks so much. And shout out to the geese that made a cameo in that uh, while you were out there. They were very aggressively honking.